I am Professor Amanda Huis. I hold the Sarchi Chair in Gender Politics in the Department of Political Science at Stellenbosch University. My research focuses on women and citizenship, women's representation in government, women's movements, and gender-based violence. Gender-based violence is a phenomenon that covers a whole spectrum of behavior, from sexual harassment such as sexist jokes, making remarks about women's bodies, objectifying women, sexual assault, rape, and intimate femicide. The statistics for rape in South Africa is very high. It's on average 50,000 rape cases reported per year, and that's very underreported. An intimate femicide is five times the global average. Uh, when a woman gets killed by her intimate partner or lover or husband. From a research perspective, we want to understand why gender-based violence is so normalized in South Africa. I'm involved in two projects. The one is on the Stellenbosch University campus to look at the normalization of rape culture. The principal investigator is Dr. Elizabeth LaRue, and we use a photo voice project. Students take cameras and they take pictures of behaviors, practices, and things students do that normalize rape culture. This project was interrupted because of the pandemic, but we will continue with this. The second project I do with Professor Jim Gibson from the United States to look at uh, the normalization of gender-based violence through a survey. We will, we will have a sample of South Africans and we will embed a, a vignette or a story in the survey. The, stu the respondents will then get asked questions about the story. There will be different versions of the story, and by looking at the variables and, and the differences in the story, we hope to, make, to find a correlation between variables that normalize gender-based violence and gender-based violence. Uh, the variables will include, for example, uh, was the evidence of the victim believable? Does she have community support? Uh, that the police believe her and other types of uh, what we call rape myths. We hope that through this study, we can contribute to understanding the normalization of gender-based violence in South Africa. My message to South Africans uh, on the 16 days of non-violence in South Africa is that this is not only a woman's problem, it is everyone's problem and we all have to get involved to find a solution. Men specifically have to call out other men who make sexist jokes, who degrade women's bodies and who assault women. By only standing together and trying to find a solution as South Africans will we deal with this violence that is so in, all-encompassing in South Africa. Please get involved. Thank you.